no one likes to talk about it. Masturbation. It's another sin that remains hidden. Masturbation is an unnatural way to gratify yourself sexually and is used to try and replace the fact that you don't have a sexual partner. If you continue to gratify yourself in this manner, you're altering the way your body responds to sexual gratification. When you do get married and have sex the way God intended it, your body may not respond the way it's supposed to naturally because you've trained it through masturbating to respond to a false stimulus when it desires sexual gratification. Again, you're creating a marital problem for yourself before your marriage even begins. Repent from this type of sin, make no provision for it, and pray for any damage to your body to be undone. You're a Christian and you shouldn't be having sex. That's the bottom line. You probably already know that premarital sex is a sin against God and your own body. So, if you've had sex in your past, if you're currently having sex, or participating in any type of foreplay-like activities outside of marriage, stop, repent, and ask God to forgive you and don't ever return to these activities again. Sexual activity is reserved for marriage only. Moving forward, don't make any preparation for sexual sin, regardless of whether you get into a serious relationship or not. If you continue to engage in sexual activity outside of marriage, you're increasingly making yourself less marketable for a man of God to want you as his wife. If you try to hide your sexual history from your future husband, the truth about you will eventually come out based on scripture. End the wait now and find out how to finally meet your husband God's way. Irresistible, the ultimate guide to marriage preparation. Order now on Amazon.com. Link in the description below. Make it your turn to finally get married. Check out our other videos and don't forget to subscribe and tap the notification bell to be informed of new videos. Like and comment with your thoughts.